Mr. Arms celebrity fitness trainer Susie Q, creator of Arms of a First Lady. I just teamed up with Rolling Out Magazine and will be rolling out with Susie Q tips. You're gonna get the latest of all the fitness tips. Join us with our Keep Fit sessions. Now let's go get Gaga and get a fit life. We are doing a Lady Gaga workout. And when people look at Lady Gaga, what's the first thing they notice? Her legs. We're gonna work the glutes and we're gonna work the legs, but the focus will be the outer thigh and hip area. You could use a dumbbell. You could use anything that's anywhere from eight to five pounds or less. If you don't have that, grab a can of soup. And we're gonna show you how to develop the body of Lady Gaga. Are you ready? Come on down on the floor with me. So here you notice I've got all the equipment except for the can of soup. I am going to position myself down as if I'm laying down on the beach. You have three different options with positioning. You can bring your elbow directly under the shoulder blade or you can come into your playboy or playgirl pose and you can situate yourself where you have your elbow extended out or you can drop the arm towards the ground and lower your head down. In case you have any neck pain, you can just relax your head right down on your arm. My position is right up here like a warrior. So first thing we're gonna do is outer hip and thigh. So I'm gonna make sure that my bottom leg is bent and the knee is right here in line with the hip. I'm gonna extend my leg straight and I've selected five pound weights and I'm gonna place it right here. Make sure you have it mid thigh. If you roll the dumbbell all the way up to the hip, it is not that effective for the leg people. So make sure you have it right here mid thigh. So we're gonna lift. Now basically what we're gonna do, you can work anywhere from eight to 15 reps if you like, and you're gonna do about anywhere from three to five sets. Now I suggest you could probably start off doing two to three. Five can be excessive. It always depends on how well developed you are and how advanced you are becoming. But always give yourself just a little time to grow and move with the movement. Now, of course, I won't be doing all of those sets with you because I want this to be very quick. So you take note and you extend that leg in the air. You keep your abdominals tight. You make sure your body is in line. And of course, Alexis, the gorgeous camera woman, is going to come around. And Alexis, just grab a nice straight profile shot right around here and come right where my bottom of my feet so you can see that I'm completely straight and bottom alignment is very important. Okay, that's enough from that angle. You can come back over here at the front now. All right, we don't want to give people too much of a show here. <laughs> so now, we're going to drop the dumbbell, but you do not relax the leg on the floor. That knee is now going to roll forward towards the ground. We're going to bring the knee down towards the ground, not to rest and relax, and extend the leg out. There is no rest for the wicked, and I know you Lady Gaga lovers are evil. So you're gonna drop that knee towards the ground and extend it. But wait, there's more. Join us as we continue our outer and hip thigh workout and we'll find out, do all women have cellulite? Mm. Tune in and do the stretch. So now you get to rest. And when you rest, I want you to bring that knee in towards the chest. Good, and you're gonna extend that leg up to the sky and you can point and flex that foot. We're gonna now bring the heel of the foot towards the buttock area or the booty. You are gonna now relax and drop that leg. We're gonna make sure that you watch your mouth and get a bit light. 